This is Luna from Ongaku to You, and these three packagings are ones I got off eBay from one of my favorite sellers on there. And it is a seller in Japan. The first one is Ya Kim's album here. And they are a Japanese hip hop group who disbanded in around 2012, I want to say. So this is one of their last albums they did, and it's actually a really good album. A lot more poppy than they used to be. But I'm very, very excited to have this one. I love Ya Kim. And the other one I got is I bought it. I finally bought it. All those who listen to our podcast, this song always makes the top 10. It always comes back up. It's Kea Kizaka 46's Kaze ni Fukura Temo. So I am actually excited to have this single as I've been listening to it enough. I might as well buy it. I got the Type B edition. So it has the CD and DVD, it has the making of the videos on there as well as the music video. So I am actually excited to get this. Unfortunately, no photo card, but not a big deal there. And the next ones I purchased are Sakura's Lover Light album. She is an older Japanese R&B singer. This CD is from 98. So this is one of her older albums, and I'm actually a big fan of her. She has a very, very soulful voice. And this is an album I've wanted to get for a long time. One of the first Japanese R&B singers I've ever heard. So I'm glad to have picked up this one finally. Next one I got is Kaori Mochita's new album. She, if you don't know who she is, she is the main vocalist from Every Little Thing. And they are a big Japanese pop trio. As you can see, it is the Obi. It has the CD and DVD with it, and a picture of Kaori herself. Twelve tracks and two videos on there. I've actually wanted to get this one for a while. So, a lot of these ones I get are older ones, so just bear with me. The next ones I got, as you can see, I haven't fully opened these. I'm going to slip this off. This is SKE's Katamoe Finally Single. And this was a very racy music video. I remember that. But I really liked the song and I really wanted to get the single. I'm starting to get into idols a little more, as you can see. CD plus DVD, very, very colorful. See the members of the group as well. And I got type A for that one. Then, yep, I got this one too. I ended up getting it. I could not help myself. So this is Nogizaka 46. And this is such a long title. But Ima... Ima hi dekiru dekiru kara itsuka. So, and I love this song so much. Or kyo dekiru, my bad. I read them separate, a separate kanji. Kyo dekiru dekiru kara itsuka. So this is the type A edition. CD and DVD, and I really like how they did the authentic Japanese track listing, just like if you're reading a book. And this is a CD that kept making the charts. I finally bought it. I am very excited to have that one in my collection as well. Next up, yes, bear with me. I bought a lot this round. These are for the last couple weeks. So this one I bought is Tiara's Emotion Album. TR is a Japanese R&B singer, very soulful voice, very beautiful too. I love the CD for this one. And this one is actually her cover album, so all these songs are actually covers. And I really liked her cover of I Miss You, which is a John Gree song. So I got that one. And Saint Vox, so those of you who don't know them, that is Jade from Sweetbox. She was really, really big back in the day. And then Emity Miyamoto, who plays the violin, so it's a combination of Jade and Emity. And this is actually the CD plus DVD version, and I had the CD only, but when I saw that DVD, I had to have it. And it is a beautiful, beautiful CD. Next up is, this is what I just got in today, so I waited. You guys get to see my whole haul. Olivia. Japanese, I would say rock. She has a very, very unique style. She has not done music in a long time. I am a huge fan of her. This is her Dress Me Up single from, I want to say, 2000 or 1999. 
and it actually has English versions of Dress Me Up and Pass Me the Sugar. And So Beautiful is also an amazing song. I have actually wanted this for a long time. A little disappointed didn't have the Obi, but also happy to have it because her stuff is super hard to find. And next up is Maylin's Candy Boy My Sweet Darling. And this was actually used for a cell phone commercial, if I'm correct. It looks like an original anime, but it was not. Maitlin was a Korean singer, but I love her song. I love these two songs. They're so good. And My Sweet Darling is actually a cover of a Yaida Hitomi song. It does have the obi, and as you can see, there's not really a booklet, just a card. So don't be surprised if you buy it, and that's not in it. And that is what the back of it looks like. And the last two. I hope you guys have bared with me this long. And you can see Misono. I got her versus single. Misono is Kotokumi's little sister. This is the my favorite song by her. She is also the leader of Day After Tomorrow. I was a huge fan of them. But I had to have this single. And it's actually kind of cool because she did a Snow White type of theme. You know, the good witch, the bad witch. And it opens very oddly too. But as you can see, and it's very red and white, so like Snow White, that does have the obi as well. Very happy to have this because this was my favorite song by her. And then the last one is Bonnie Pink Sumitai Ame single. And I actually bought this for the concert. It actually has some live clips on it, and I love Bonnie Pink Live. So it has her Dear Diary at Asakusa. And that's why I purchased this one. So as you can see, it has a couple songs from 2010. She's very hard to find live performances of, unless you buy her stuff. So I wanted to pick that one up as well. And these are all my eBay CDs, as you can see. I've gotten a lot lately. But thank you guys for watching, and I look forward to more from me. This is Luna from Ongaku to you.